Hey, I'm Joshua Richardson. And because the weather's hopefully starting to warm up soon, it's a good time to think about dewinterizing. Um, the first step in dewinterizing is to put water into your fresh tank. So that's what we're doing right here. It's pretty easy. I mean, you just find your fresh tank and put water in it. Now that we got some water in a fresh tank, we're going to head inside for the next step. The next step is locating your water pump. And you want to check and see if you have a winterizing hose attached to it. And if you do, you want to turn the valve to normal operation so your water pump starts sucking from your fresh tank. Okay, after we get our pump in normal operation, the next step is to turn on our water pump and then open every faucet on the hot and cold side until all the pink is gone. The last step in dewinterizing, after we've gone to every faucet and gotten all the pink out, is to find the back side of the water heater to turn the water heater bypass valves. It may be one valve, two valves, or three valves. On this particular model, it's only two valves. So you just take the valves and turn them 90 degrees. As you can see, the process of dewinterizing isn't very difficult, but it is a service we provide at Rich & Sons. Once again, I'm Josh, so give us a call and have a happy camping season.